Lehigh Valley and welcome to Real Estate Video Tips with Heather Martin. Um, in today's tip, we're going to talk about um, the MLS. And, you know, buyers always want to get the get on the best search and be able to find properties on their own. Well, you know, what is the MLS and how do you get direct access? Well, the Multiple Listing Service was created in 1999 in Lehigh Valley. And the purpose of it was actually to form a contract between listing agents who represent the seller and buyer agents who represent the buyer. So it's actually a contract that says between, that the listing agent is going to offer so much commission to the buyer's agent. But in, a, in addition to that, of course, we also have the ability to share our listings through the, the MLS with all of the other websites out there, like your Century 21 and your Remax and your Zillow and your Trulia and your Realtor.com and all that stuff. So once a listing agent signs a contract with a seller to list their property on the market, on that contract, it says what permission the seller is giving the listing agent in order to broadcast their property on the internet, okay? And so once that listing agent puts all the information into the multiple listing service, which is actually the Greater Lehigh Valley Association of Realtors, which we pay a membership every three months to be part of, once they put that information in there and they push the enter key, you will, if you are working with a professional licensed real estate agent as a buyer agent in the Lehigh Valley, you will actually get that listing will come to you as long as it fits your criteria. So the best way for you to get the most accurate um, available listings on the market is to work with a professional real estate agent and have a search set up in the MLS. Well, the information that is then broadcasted out to all the other, and what they call it is syndicated, um, but all that information comes from the multiple listing service. So the problem with going to your Zillows and your Trulias and your, you know, Century 21 sites or, or Remax or whatever realtor broker, whatever broker offer you just, uh, office you decide to go to on the MLS, some of that some of that information may not be as accurate as the MLS. So in any case, hopefully.